So bathing a hedgehog. We need to put her somewhere where she can't escape. Like a sink like this is deep enough where she can't get out. We just get nice warm water here. And I have baby wash. And we'll do a few squirts of that into the water. It probably only needs to be two or three inches deep. Theoretically, she swims, but I'm not going to risk that. All right, so I picked her up with a towel because, as you can see, she's very spiky and she does not like being woken up. She is nocturnal. So I will gently roll her over here. You can see her little face in there. And I will set her slowly in the water and she will not drown. She will perk her little head up. Come here. There we go. So she doesn't really need her back washed. She mostly just needs her feet to be cleaned from with the poop. So, so we try not to scare her too much, but we get one leg at a time here and then just clean underneath her nails and pinch off any dirt, poop, basically, that gets stuck on her little paws, like that little black speck right there. We'll just pick it off, leave her alone. See if she'll let us get the back leg here clean. And the other one. And there she is, nice and clean. And, and then we just kind of get our hands underneath her because we don't want to grab her spikes. And we pick her up and put her on our little towel. And all she really wants, especially during the daytime, is just to be covered up and held for a little while until her soft little belly hair gets dry. We're doing this at about eight o'clock at night, so she's perkier. She will be much grumpier for you guys, I'm sorry, but this is Harley.